April is Limb Loss Awareness Month, and for those with artificial limbs, a golf outing has been a very special event of the summer. Stacy Powers from Comprehensive Prosthetics and Orthotics is here with more on this year's event, which is nearly full. So yes. many people are taking part. Yes, we're so excited. We, we started four years ago with about 60 golfers, and we are almost full this year. We are, we're so excited about the support from the community this year. What a neat thing. Um, the folks who are missing limbs and have uh, mm, prosthetics, normally get to take part in something like a golf outing is that you know there are there are a few around the country um there are a few um within iowa and illinois uh, we wanted to do something local for our our local patients mm -hmm. and um so we we wanted to to bring everybody together from the surgeon to the patient to the therapist to our practitioner and we thought this would be a great way to do it. Yeah, because it, it's the whole, you mentioned the, the, su the support staff. Yes. And, and you guys su supply these, uh, these very needed uh, you know, help situations for yes. these folks. What is that like for you? You know, it's one of the most rewarding and challenging um, jobs. Um, I am not a clinician, but our practitioners, um, they, they deserve all the credit. They work very hard to get our patients back to, to the mobility that they, they strive to have. I mean, just think the, these folks get their lives back yes. because of what you guys do. Yes, absolutely. Um, I, I want to show, we have a couple pictures of a client of yours named Dan. Yes. Who, uh, who lost one of his legs in an accident at work. Yes, yes. It was crushed, his leg was crushed, correct? Yes, it was. And, and look at him now. He did a leg of the Bix, uh, what was it, last year? Yes, last he did. Just last year? Yes. When you see that, what does that do for you? So Dan is one of our um, most special patients. You know, he's been an amputee for close to 20 years. And mm. last year he decided that he wanted to run. He was told he probably would never get to run again. And so we said, let's do it. And mm. we got together and got him his running legs that he needed. Okay. And uh, he did it and he accomplished it and we're so proud of him. Do you have other examples like that of people who are taking part in the golf outing, Stacey? What other uh, other kinds of situations? Yes, yes. So we have um, patients that are either amputees due to vascular issues, due to traumatic injuries, um, some cancer patients. And so we get um, patients with all different sorts of backgrounds that come in. Mm -hmm. um, some are new golfers uh, some have wanted to get back to the course um, but they all come and i can tell you that it's one of their favorite days it's one of our favorite days of the entire year and um, it's it's just great to have everybody out and all the smiles and laughter that's so neat yes. so we're, we're seeing some some pictures of, of of you folks gathering together for that was the last outing did you do one last year for 21 we did, we okay. did. yes well, so w we, we had you on this early to talk about this event, which is coming yes. up in July, mm -hmm. because the spots are filling up already. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. The, uh, a lot of these folks wouldn't be able to golf in any other situation, probably. Mm -hmm. And so uh, so you provide this opportunity. And it is coming up. It, it's, it, it's being played at Palmer, yes. Palmer, uh, Palmer, Palmer Hills in, in Bettendorf. Mm -hmm. And the date is? July 15th. July 15th. So uh, so we invite, so if there are some folks thinking, you know, um, the other people who would take part would be family and friends and other supporters yeah. of, of these folks? Yeah, so we invite um, all of our amputees. Um, they'll either bring family members or friends and they come, come out for a day of golf. We have quite a few um, surgeons and physicians that are partaking this year, mm. um, therapists, and then anybody that just wants to support, really. Um, I've, you know, this, this event has gained momentum over the years and mm -hmm. I have people that have stopped me out at a restaurant and said, I wanna, I wanna help you, I wanna support. So oh, that's cool. we are, we're very excited for this year. The cost to enter? So the cost to ever is um, 75 per golfer. All of our amputees are free of charge. Mm -hmm. well, so we take go. care of them. Yes. Yeah, yes. sure you do. Yes. Uh, are you able to use some of that, of that leftover money in some way? Yeah. yeah, so we typically, it's a break even event. If there is any leftover money, mm -hmm. we um, use it for our amputee support groups. And mm -hmm. we actually yeah. are looking to restart a local amputee support group um, because after COVID, we lost some of our leaders, and unfortunately. Mm -hmm. And so um, we do have a chapter in Peoria. Um, that we help support, and we're also looking to start one here locally again. Wow, well that, that's good, big news. Yes, yeah. yes. So we're looking at the info for the Comprehensive Prosthetics and Orthotics Amputee Golf Outing. It is coming up at Palmer Hills in Bettendorf 
on the 15th of July. Now, so you're thinking, you know, here we are at the end of April, but there, um, this will be full. This will be full it, this year. It yes. absolutely will be. Yes. And and what an opportunity and a special thing that you guys have provided. So that's that's so much. Thank you so much. Thank you for letting us share this this great event. Thanks, Stacy. Good seeing you.